Hello YouTube, what's up? Metro here, 2012 here. We are finally back for the Minecraft 3X project. It has been a while since I've recorded a video for this. There's been kind of a lot of reasons for it. Um, I'll just go ahead and say the main reason is there wasn't a lot of support in the on the series so far, but um, today I was just kind of going back, looking at my old YouTube videos, and realized how much fun I was having doing this so um, I'm gonna continue this series just based off of how much fun I'm having with it and then hopefully eventually people will um, kind of start to recognize that it's pretty cool and start watching but um, I, I was just really really missing this this kind of world I had created and wanted to, to keep going on it so we're starting it right back up again um, this would be episode it's, it's getting close to 20 um, I believe I still have another one to upload, so I'm not going to um, say what the episode is, especially if I'm wrong, but um, we're going to pick it up and keep going here. So, um, if you remember from the last couple episodes, I had started building my tower. On uh, this episode, I'm going to work specifically on uh, getting a little bit more uh, cobblestone for my tower, as well as I also need coal, because I can't put it in the furnace if I don't have any uh, coal to make the, the stone with out of the cobblestone so we're gonna have to go into the mine but right now I'm just kind of checking out what I did and I'm pretty sure that I'm gonna take this staircase down I just don't see it working very well I think I'm going to put a ladder inside of the tower um, to get up and down and then I'm going to have staircases inside the actual castle itself but as far as the the watchtowers go I'm just gonna have some ladders in there to make it a little bit easier okay so we're back down in the mine and what I'm going to do is create another mine shaft, <clears throat> and this one I'm going to to, to um, decorate, so to speak, just a little bit differently than normal. Um, you can see that uh, the one that I had already done looks really, really cool because I I kind of dug it all the way down and then did the stairway down. So there's a big like open area when you go all the way down the stairs. I'm doing something very similar with this one, but yet a little bit different. So it's going to go all the way down and then it's going to stop and then the lighting is going to be within the wall so it's not going to be poking out like it does um, on the other one it's going to look really cool actually so then <clears throat> the first part of this video will simply just be creating this um, this long um, essentially tunnel that just encompasses this really cool like digging mine thing but uh, what I'm doing is making sure I get all the coal that I possibly can. I really need to um, stack up on that so that I can make some more stone out of my cobblestone uh, to keep going on that castle. So there is an actual purpose to doing this. I'm not just mining to mine. I really do need to gather resources at this point. Um, I do a few up, a few other cool things in this episode, so I hope you really enjoy that as well. But <clears throat> uh, the, as far as this portion goes, I think this is a really cool way of doing mines. Um, I know a lot of people just like to strip mine and like to just do whatever is easiest to get stuff and I know there are strategies to it. Um, for me, I just, I like things to be organized and I'm kind of, um, if you've seen my other videos, I'm kind of OCD about Minecraft. I like things to be neat and cool. I like doing things different ways. So when I'm doing uh, my mine shaft, I do cool stuff like this. Um, which I just find really enjoyable so so you can see at the end here I'm kind of giving this a weird backlight effect so um, the end of the the mine shaft will appear as if that whole wall is lit up but you won't be able to see the torches when you're going down so it's gonna it's gonna look really really cool when it's done very similar to the other one but just the lighting is hidden within um, the wall so it'll look a little bit more clean and I think it'll be really really cool so I think you should let me know in the comments what you guys think about this type of mine shaft and let me know if you honestly think I'm just wasting my time or if you think it's really cool too. So I'd really like to hear that. Um, and for those of you who know how strip mining works and what levels things are, you should let me know that as well so that I can kind of plan out where my strip mines can eventually go. But for right now, I really like this, uh, this mine shaft idea, having a nice organized mine. Um, my other mine actually made it all the way down to a really big open area as you could probably tell in the last episode if you watched it and um, I did a little bit of exploring and 
collecting in that episode. It was it was really fun to do that. I was it was a live stream episode, and I had someone kind of watching and uh, commenting as I was doing it. So that's something I also hope to continue doing is live streaming, and hopefully some people tune in, uh, and I can get some feedback and some questions, make it more of an interactive episode rather than just me talking over all this, but. I, either way, it's just really fun for me. Like I said, I just stopped because the views weren't there, but um, looking back on it, I just saw how much fun I was really having with it, so I just wanted to, to keep going and uh, do it for my own sake, and then hopefully, hopefully, eventually it'll catch on. So now I'm just going to clean up this bottom portion uh, because I had to go down one more row to put those, those torches in. So I'm just going to take that out quick and then we're going to head back up to the surface and get some stuff done. Just gave you a quick look of what that looks like. Alright, so we're going to head in and I believe now I'm just kind of going to throw all the stone in, assess my inventory. Um, we're going to start heading over to the sheep pen because I got a, a pretty cool idea for what we can do over at the sheep pen. Uh, I know I, I could go and get some wheat so then we can... I'll make some cow and sheep babies so I can start the uh, reproduction process so that I can get all my meat I need to survive and get all my wool and hopefully um, make some more sheep uh, dye their dye their wool different color when I get some more dye so we're still working on the sheep farm and um, next episode um, what I believe I'm going to do is finish up the next sheep pen as well as put a building around my wheat farm so as of right now there's no building around my wheat farm um, as you see here, there's no building, but uh, hopefully by the end of the next episode I'll have a building around it um, just to make things look a little bit neater. I have more of a little community here rather than just things thrown around all the, all the place. But I, I just think it's this particular um, save means a lot to me for some reason. Like going back and watching the videos, when you think about it, I had almost 20 videos, half hour each, so it's. About uh, close to 10 hours I have in this, a little bit less than that, but 10 hours is a lot to have into one game and all the inventory I've collected over that time and all the cool stuff I've built and I'm really just getting started in it, which is really cool because I, I don't even have one tower done of this castle and it literally I'm planning on making it a really cool castle. So if you guys want to see some building projects, definitely stay tuned uh, on this channel and here I'm a little embarrassed I could not figure out for the life of me how to make shears because obviously it's been like a year since I've done this 3x project and it's been a year since I've played Minecraft so uh, I, I had to look it up quick how to make shears just so I could go and collect the sheep wool and so here I head over to the sheep pens and we're going to do a little reproduction stuff and get some sheep wool and you'll see what I do with it I think it's kind of a cool idea and I also want to know what your idea is on, <clears throat> on me me doing this I don't want to spoil it but as you can see I have successfully reproduced the white sheep and sheared them and then now I'm going to reproduce the gray sheep and the black sheep and then kill off the white sheep that are in this pen just because they're kind of in the way and I already have white sheep in another pen so I just want gray and black in, in this pen. And there goes the white sheep. And I don't want it to sound racist, but I did just kill off the white sheep in the black pen just to make things a little bit uh, less diversified, which is bad. But um, And now I go and take all the... I don't know if the cyan amp, but it's like a baby blue... I'm going to check and see the last pen is not completed yet, so I'm going to need some some stone for that. So here is my idea here. I am labeling outside of the sheep pens with the color of the sheep that's in them. Um, maybe it's lame, but I think it's, it's kind of cool. I know I can just look in the door and see what they are, but once this is all said and done, there's going to be a lot of pens here and a lot of different colors, so it's going to be good to just look at the color and see what's going on. I noticed there I kind of miscounted when I was making the pen somehow. Um, didn't have the right amount of squares. I had four on one end and three on the other. Uh, got laid on me so I'd head back home and then believe I do a little bit of inventory things uh, and head to bed because it's been a long successful day in the world of Minecraft. Um, 
I started in a cool mine shaft and did a little work on my sheet pens and just stay tuned, come back for the next episode if you want to see me complete the sheet pens and if you want to see me build a, uh, a cool looking structure around the wheat farm, uh, that'll definitely be in the next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode and I hope you tune in for the next one. I'll see you there.